Hey guys, I wanted to make this video this morning because there was something driving me crazy for two hours. So I built this dual device amp with a pair of ART2Ks, the latest device from Amplion. Set it all up, set the IDQ for about four amps, set it up with uh, the connections to the radio and uh, driving it with RF in and nothing coming out. I'd see the resting current of four amps, but uh, nothing else. So I'm checking everything to make sure, you know, I didn't forget to solder something down. And then I get to the input. So over here on the input, I lifted one side of the transformer off ground, but yet I still had a short on that trace. And there was a small, what I would even call a whisker of copper from here to the trace. So boy, you know, it's too bad RF loves ground. So I came over here after I lifted that trace and just started to clean this up. It was so small, you couldn't even see it. So as soon as I got over here with the, the scraping tool, I saw this little tiny trace from here to here. So just a word to the wise, if you ever have everything all set up and everything looks good, the devices look good, but you get no power out. You know, these things will operate into an open. So if you have no power out and you're looking for a short. So I just wanted to pass this little bit of information on, hopefully save somebody some aggravation because it drove me crazy for two hours.